everyone. Good morning. Welcome to the All CPP Pro Day. Uh, it is a web page programming using HTML and JavaScript. So chapter one is the introduction to HTML. HTML stands for Hypertext Markup Language, and it is the most widely used language to write web pages. Hypertext refers to the way in which web pages or HTML documents are linked together. Thus, the link available on a web page is called hypertext. As its name suggests, HTML is a markup language, which means you use HTML to simplify markup, a text document with tags that tell a web browser how to structure it to display. Originally, HTML was developed with the intent of defining the structure of documents like headings, paragraphs, lists, and so forth to facilitate the sharing of scientific information between researchers. Now, HTML is being widely used to format web pages with the help of different tags available in HTML language. So we have here an example of basic HTML document. In its simplest form, uh, following is an example of HTML document. HTML tags, as told earlier, HTML is a markup language and makes use of various tags to format the content. These tags are enclosed within uh, angle bra braces tag names. So except few tags, most of the tags have their corresponding closing tags. For example, HTML has its closing tag slash HTML, and body tag has its closing tag slash body tag, etc. Here are examples of HTML documents uses the following tags. So we have the doc type. This tag defines the document type and HTML version. The HTML, this tag encloses the complete HTML document and mainly comprises the document header which is represented by head and slash head and document body, which is represented by body slash body tags. So here, head, this tag represents the documents, headers, which can keep other HTML tags like titles, link, etc. Title, the title tag is used to, uh, inside the head tag to mention the document title. Body, this tag represents the document's body, which keeps other HTML tags like h1, div, p, etc. h1, this tag represents the heading, and p, this tags represent paragraph. So HTML basic tags. Tags are the basic units or building blocks of uh, HTML file. Web pages are designed and HTML codes are made up of these tags. They control how the HTML does its structuring, laying out and formatting. Tags are enclosed in angle brackets. And an example of it is uh, angle bracket HTML, then followed by the closing angle bracket. HTML files are divided into two parts, the head and the body. Uh, these contents in the head parts are enclosed in head slash head and contents in the body parts are enclosed in body slash body. So what are body tags? Everything that appears on your web pages, may it be text, the images, the videos, etc., should then be put in the body, which is enclosed in body slash body. The P tag offers a way to structure your text into different paragraphs. Each paragraph of text should go in between an opening P and a closing slash p. Heading tags. Any document starts with a heading. You can use different sizes for your headings. HTML also has six levels of headings, which use the elements h1, h2, h3, h4, h5, and h6. So while displaying any heading, browser adds one line before and one line after the heading. So this is a sample code for heading. So that's the end of chapter one.
For more ICCT Colleges video updates, please subscribe and click the notification button.